your country crazy evening news break. Pretend you has the freedom of the city of York stripped by council. First out and threatens to unleash terrors on earth on Troy who made Rainer remark. We told the mail on Sunday that Miss Rainer crossed and uncrossed her legs in a labor in an attempt to distract the Prime Minister. Tennessee propane cowboys meth drug bust in East Tennessee nets 16 indictments. Google embraces woke cultural. You will now be flagged for using politically incorrect words while searching. Attorney General Merrick Garland balks at special prosecutor for Hunter Biden when Senator points out obvious conflict of interest. You think? That tells Joe it's time to go when he wants to seek re-election. Whistleblower who aided investigation had Dutch Bank and Donald Trump found dead in Los Angeles. Fusion GPS revealed to have pushed Russia collusion story to numerous outlets. Heartbreak on Capitol Hill as Democrats come to realization about January 6th committee. They're going into overdrive and giving the stories their best spins to hopes of distracting people from the self-destruction currently taking place within the Democratic Party. Mary Jo Green, martial law text could boost case to keep her off the ballot. Cousin 14 is arrested for strangling and then sexually assaulting Wisconsin girl Lily Peters, 10, to death. Told cops he wanted to break her and intended to kill her as he walked her home from aunt's house. Pray for the family. The CDC and the FDA altered COVID guidance and even suppressed findings while under political pressure. Bombshell reports suggest whistleblower employees say they feared retaliation if they spoke up. Elon Musk slams Truth Social's terrible name and says it only exists because Twitter censored free speech as the billionaire toes the line over his buyout, non disparting clause. Got a little tongue tied there. And TikTok erupts with wild conspiracy theories that Amber Heard's lawyer is as Johnny Depp fan after uses spotted a look like woman in the crowd at 2013 premiere for his movie, Lone Ranger. Population increased by $1 million in Biden's first year in office and cost the taxpayers an extra $9.4 billion. I'll say again, $9.4 billion. Conservative group research reveals. And senators say it's res- ridiculous of Biden considering counsel on all student loan debt because it will raise taxes by $13,000 per person and make inflation worse. And 65% of Americans don't have a college degree. Before Washington's nerd prom, lots of risk-benefit calculations, the New York Times says with Fauci. Is it safe for President Joe Biden to attend the so-called nerd prom, otherwise known as the White House Correspondents' Dinner? Should the dinner even be held? And over $5 million is missing from President Biden's transparency reports, the report states. Joe Biden declared $7 million more in income in his tax returns than claimed on the government transparency reports following his time in the vice president's and at least $5 million of the extra income unaccounted for. Country Crazy's Evening News.